Hey everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to a brand new video. In today's video, we're going to be going over all the information you need to know about the release of Red Dead Redemption 2 on the PC. So today, Rockstar published a blog post where they officially confirmed Red Dead Redemption 2 for the PC, along with a ton of information we're going to be discussing today. So we got a ton of really awesome things to discuss today. So I recommend you guys check out the entire video. And also, if you have not already, be sure to drop a like and also subscribe down below for more daily videos just like this. But let's go ahead and get right into the two quick shout outs of the day and right after that we'll get into the actual video. So today's first quick shout out of the day goes to a really awesome YouTube channel known as Celebrity Mom. She uploads a ton of really awesome in real life videos including helpful informative videos and also some really awesome vlogs as well. She has a great variety of content over on her channel so definitely be sure to check it out in the description down below and see her latest video about how to make YouTube custom thumbnails for free on the internet. And today's final quick shout out of the day goes to a really awesome alt-rock and pop-punk band based out of Scranton, Pennsylvania. They recently signed with a new management label and they have a brand new EP releasing in early 2020. If you're a fan of any type of rock music, definitely be sure to check out their channel in the description down below and see some of their awesome music today. But with that being said, and without further ado, let's go ahead and hop right on in into this video. So less than 24 hours after I posted my video from yesterday regarding the PC version of Red Dead Redemption 2, Rockstar released an official blog post on their newswire announcing the game. So Red Dead Redemption 2 will be coming to the PC on November 5th. Pre-orders will open up on October 9th, and you're going to be getting a ton of free goodies when you pre-order, especially through the Rockstar Games launcher, but also on October 9th is going to be some vital information that Rockstar will be releasing on their newswire. So there's a couple pieces of information that we will be getting on October 9th, which is only a couple days away from now, that will be very important to see about Red Dead Redemption 2 on the PC. So the first thing we will be seeing on October 9th is the first ever gameplay of Red Dead Redemption 2 on the PC with the official announcement trailer. I do expect the trailer to be very stunning and very beautiful. Obviously, it will be uploaded in 4K across all platforms, and I cannot wait to see what it looks like. On top of that, Rockstar will be releasing a blog post where they discuss all the details about the features of the PC version of Red Dead Redemption 2. These are mainly going to be graphics features, but it also is very important to see. Not only are we going to be getting a confirmation whether ray tracing, which is the advanced technology that allows light rays to be individually mapped within a video game will be making its way into Red Dead Redemption 2. But on top of that, we're also going to be getting some really important information about the system specifications needed to run Red Dead Redemption 2 normally. Now with Red Dead 2 being a more advanced game than GTA 5 in pretty much every aspect, I do expect it to have much higher system qualifications and specifications requirements than GTA 5 for the PC. Now, if you don't have a powerful PC or you simply don't want to use your PC to play Red Dead Redemption 2, listen up because this is going to be a major announcement that no one is discussing. Red Dead Redemption 2 will be released on Google Stadia in November as well. Now, Google Stadia, of course, is Google's cloud gaming platform where you stream your games over the internet and overall, it is actually pretty impressive. So you can play virtually any game on your TV, PC, laptop, phone, tablet, any device that supports Google Stadia, and Red Dead Redemption 2 will be added to their catalog. I'm super happy to see this announcement, and I'm really upset that not many people are discussing it, but nonetheless, this is a huge milestone for Rockstar and cloud gaming in general. Another thing to note here is that on October 9th, when pre-orders do go live, don't bother checking the Steam store because Red Dead Redemption 2 for the PC will not be available on Steam. I personally recommend ordering the game from the Rockstar Games launcher. Not only are you going to be ordering it directly from Rockstar, but on top of that, they're throwing in a ton of really awesome goodies as well as long as you do pre-order on time. Now, if for whatever reason you don't want to pre-order from the Rockstar Games launcher, it is also going to be available on the Epic Games Store, which is a big rumor that has been going around. It is now officially confirmed. So it's going to be available on the Epic Game Store, Green Man Gaming, the Humble Store, GameStop, as well as a handful of other digital retailers starting on October 23rd. Now, if you were paying attention to the dates I was discussing earlier, that does mean that you will be able to pre-order the game earlier on the Rockstar Games launcher than everywhere else. For details regarding bonuses, discounts, and other details like that, check out the link in the description down below to the Rockstar Newswire where they discuss everything you need to know. In terms of Google Stadia, 
media, they did not provide any exact dates. However, they did say it will be coming out, quote, sometime in November. But nonetheless, pretty much everyone, including myself, is simply waiting until October 9th, which is when Rockstar is going to be releasing all the information they have on this game for us. And I am super excited to see the official gameplay trailer and see what Rockstar has in store for us in terms of the high graphics quality that is possible on the PC. Now, if any console players are watching this or people that are just simply not interested in buying the PC version, don't worry, the console versions will obviously continue being updated with the latest Red Dead Online content and patches, and in fact, the consoles are probably Rockstar's highest priority over PC. But if you want to check out Rockstar's announcement from today on their newswire, I'll make sure to put a link in the description down below, but I definitely want to hear from you guys in the comment section down below, what is one thing you want to see Rockstar add into the PC version of Red Dead Redemption 2 that is not available on the console version? Any and all ideas you have, let me know in the comment section down below because I really want to hear from you guys. But either way, that is pretty much going to wrap it up for today. If you guys did enjoy this video or if you guys learned something new, make sure you guys drop a like. And also, if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe down below with those bell notifications on so you guys are always notified whenever I upload a brand new video. But either way, thank you very much for tuning in today. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you guys tomorrow with it another video just like this. But until then, have an awesome day and I'll be sure to talk to you guys then.